Hey everyone, welcome back to Melissa's Kitchen Table. Today I have a Costco grocery haul for you. And I have a small little haul from a, a local grocery store as well. Um, first things first, I have the upside down toilet paper. We always buy the Kirkland brand. It's always the best uh, price and we like it. And I'll show you the two receipts here so you guys can see the prices of everything. Because a lot of times I forget what the heck they are. All right, so the tissue was $16.99. I'll start over here. So, my, don't mind my dirty sink. I haven't gotten there yet. Um, we're almost out of our pods for the dishwasher, and this one was $19.99 on sale for $15.99. Um, and sometimes the cheaper ones just don't work as good because we do put a lot of our Tupperware in there because um, we take that for work, lunch, and all of that. So I wanted to see how this one works. And it was on sale $15.99. We love sour cream. My husband never used to eat sour cream, but I think now that he's getting older, his taste is changing, and he likes sour cream. And honestly, for $3.99, you can't go wrong. All right, so they had the Columbus rotisserie seasoned chicken breast this was $13.28 and all of these types of packages were four dollars off so I got it for $9.28 which is a great price because this is just under two pounds so we'll freeze some of it I personally do not like most lunch meat um, but my husband will put this in a salad um, so yeah I got that for him because it was on sale and then I figured I would get this sweet kale chop salad. Um, it's the whole kit. It has broccoli, Brussels sprouts, cabbage, kale, chicory, dried cranberries, roasted pumpkin seeds. It has a poppy seed dressing. I don't know if he'll like that. We're kind of picky with dressings. So he could just take this and this and put whatever salad dressing he wants on it. So I cannot remember who called this, uh, but... It just sounded really, really good. I love guacamole and we love salsa. Um, tomorrow, my niece is making her Holy Communion. So I figured I would bring some of this up. I'm also going to be making a buffalo chicken dip that I'm going to do a video on. So I grabbed this. It was on sale for, I believe, $6.99. I'm pretty sure. But it just, it looks so good. So hopefully that's good. Then I've never seen these before. Uh, Green Ridge Farms Natural Beef Snack Stick. Look at these things. They're freaking crazy long. I just thought they were pretty cool. And my husband loves stuff like this. Um, yeah, and they're all natural. Oof, I don't know about that, but he won't know. <laughs> so these were, I think, $13.49, $13.59. I just thought they were pretty cool because they're, like, super long. Um, but yeah, so we'll give these a try. Um, and the good thing is you could throw these in the freezer too. Like take one package out, throw the other ones in the freezer. Um, their asparagus looked really good. I can't remember the price. $5.99 for two and a quarter pounds. We love, 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 love asparagus. So I grabbed that and I grabbed a huge thing of broccoli. So it's really disappointing that my Costco never has the organic bag broccoli anymore they used to like last year um but i haven't seen it anymore and i'm not going to be going to another store and we love broccoli too that's like our second favorite i was going to get the block of cheddar because it's like 539 and i was going to make the buffalo chicken dip with it but then i said you know what this one's like 12 dollars, which granted is a heck of a lot more but this one's five pounds of cheese. The other one was only two. And it's already shredded for me. So it'll just be super quick and easy. So I grabbed that. And then for cleaning, I needed a big thing of vinegar. So then my husband's working uh, really late or quite a bit this weekend. So I wanted to bring him some dinner. And I was out and about. So I grabbed him a rotisserie chicken from a local grocery store. I brought that for him and the other guys work in um but i grabbed a small thing of milk typically i don't buy milk usually i'll buy half and half or heavy cream or light cream whatever for coffee but i don't know i don't feel like cooking dinner and i just bought a thing of rice krispies i never buy cereal unless it's for uh, my husband to bring to work 
uh, but I was just really wanting Rice Krispies, and I said, well, that's super easy. And I got a thing of the Marzetti Classic Ranch for that buffalo chicken dip, as well as the Frank's Red Hot for the buffalo chicken dip. And I grabbed some of the Green Giant Rice Veggies. When I go to Whole Foods or Trader Joe's next time, I'm going to stock up on them because they're cheaper at those places. And they're just as good. And I know those are non-GMO. These, I don't know. Um, I grabbed these just to throw in the freezer. It was two bags of Gavadel. They were two for three, so $1.50 a piece, which is really good. And my husband likes uh, sausage, broccoli, and Gavadel, so I figured I can make that for dinner. That I showed you. Got some cheese to put in the salad with the chicken. And then, like I said before, my niece is having her Holy Communion tomorrow, so I'm going to be making some cupcakes for her, and they are gluten-free. Um, so it's just easier for me to buy the box mix than get all the special flowers and all of that because I know they like the taste of this. And this little cup of fruit was $3.29 and it just looked really, really good to me. Um, my husband won't eat melon or watermelon. He'll only eat the pineapple, so I wasn't going to get a whole fruit and cut it up. And then they had two ears of corn on sale for a dollar. So I grabbed that, and that is Kane letting me know he needs to come in. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe and share, and I'll talk to you all next time. Bye.